Hi Nakama, welcome back again to my channel North Tube. This is the best sword fights epic in One Piece anime, ever. In the vast world of One Piece, where pirates and warriors roam, the art of swordsmanship takes center stage. These fights not only showcase the characters' incredible skills but also highlight their growth, determination, and unwavering passion. This battle has become an iconic moment that defines the greatness of the series. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe if you like this video. Enjoy watching. Starting at number 10 is Zoro vs. Koku, Eni's Lobby Arc. Koku might seem like a goofball, but he is surprisingly creative with his swordsmanship. By turning into a giraffe with his Zoan Devil fruit, he could pull his neck into his torso and fire it off like a cannon. Alternatively, he can give himself longer arms and legs for better reach. Lung. This is Zoro's most hard-fought victory before the One Piece time skip. Koku pushed him to his very limit, which is why Zoro had to resort to using the Ashura, Ichibujin, a sword technique that gives Zoro nine swords instead of the usual three. <laughs> Number 9. Brook vs. Ryuma, Thriller Bark Arc. Even when he is nothing more than a rotting corpse, Shimosuke Ryuma is still a major threat in the One Piece series. He wields the cursed blade Shusui, also known as the national treasure of Wano country. Unfortunately for the skeletal musician, the zombified samurai was able to directly copy all his techniques. Despite the power discrepancy, Brook didn't back down from the fight, even when his bones were starting to shatter. He should be admired for his great display of courage, even in the face of death. Number 8. Dracula Hawk vs. Vista, Marine Ford. In the midst of a chaotic war, these powerful swordsmen decided to engage in a very casual duel, complementing each other's abilities. It's more of a conversation than a complete battle, yet Mihawk and Vista make it seem cool. Mihawk also manages to defend himself using a single longsword, Yuru, while Vista resorts to using twin blades. Composure goes a long way in maintaining a battle stance. That's what makes someone like Mihawk so terrifying. Number 7. Silver's Rayleigh vs. Kizaru, Sabayadi Arc. It was a very brief encounter, but it's clear that both men have been in scraps involving swords before. Rayleigh and Kizaru make great use of their long-range weaponry as they parry their attacks back and forth. Rayleigh may not be as strong as he used to be in the One Piece series, but he still has a showing here. Rayleigh hadn't even held a sword in years, but he still kept up with the Admiral. <laughs> Number 6. 
Kazuki Odin vs Ashura Doji. This epic showdown takes place during the tumultuous Wano country arc, where the fate of the nation hangs in the balance. The battle between these two warriors is not just a physical confrontation, but also a clash of ideologies and personal convictions. With his two legendary swords, Ame no Habakiri and Enma, Odin's mastery of swordsmanship is unmatched. Ashura Doji, initially hesitant to join Odin's cause, engages in this battle to test Odin's resolve and determine if he truly has what it takes to bring about the change Wano desperately needs. <laughs> Number 5. Rorino Azoro vs Ryuma, Thriller Bark. <laughs> Zoro did what Brook was unable to do against Ryuma. He cut down the swordsman in a mid-air clash, via the powerful Hiryu Kin. It turns out that having a stronger physical build makes a world of difference. Ryuma accepted his defeat in a respectful manner and even gave Zoro his prized sword. It wasn't a battle for the sake of a battle in the One Piece series. Rather, it was a generational shift between great swordsmen. Number 4. Kazuki Odin vs. Whitebeard. The clash between Kazuki Odin and Edward Newgate, better known as Whitebeard, in One Piece is a battle that brings together two legendary figures of immense power and influence. This encounter was truly an extraordinary spectacle, coupled with a powerful clash of King's Haki. When these two King's Haki clashed, the clash of their swords sent out an extremely powerful shockwave, signifying the clash of high-level King's Haki power. The fight between Kazuki Odin and Whitebeard will forever be etched as an epic clash between the two titans, leaving an indelible mark on the hearts of fans. Number 3. Zoro vs Mihawk, Barity Arc. At the start of the One Piece series, the world's greatest swordsman casually cleaved a wooden ship in half with little effort. This was proven during a very short duel, where Mihawk only needed a small knife to face Zoro, unable to even penetrate the defense of Mihawk who only used a knife. <laughs> This was a dazzling performance from the number one swordsman. Zoro's crushing defeat left a difference in power levels between him and his latest foe. Despite this, he enjoyed small triumphs in defeat, as Mihawk recognized his potential in the One Piece series. Number 2. Goldie Roger vs. Whitebeard. 
来たが The clash between Goldie, Roger, the Pirate King, and Whitebeard, in One Piece is a legendary encounter that symbolizes the pinnacle of power and the incredible clash of powers in the series. This monumental battle between the two most formidable pirates in history has enormous significance, and captivates the imagination of fans around the world. The clash of their powerful Haki-infused attacks resounded and left devastation in their wake. Roger's mastery of the sword, combined with his incredible Haki abilities, pushed the boundaries of what was considered possible, while Whitebeard with his earthquake devil fruit was devastating. <laughs> Zoro vs King, Wano Country It can be argued that King was Zoro's first real challenge after the One Piece time skip. Kaido's right-hand man nearly broke Zoro's blade with his sword breaker. The Lunarian was a constant threat whenever he used hit-and-run techniques, in conjunction with his fire manipulation. Haki is the only reason he didn't perish in a fiery explosion. In the end, Zoro was forced to use his most powerful technique, Ien Santri, Demon King of Hell. Not only did he cut through a magma dragon, Zoro also destroyed King's sword and severed his wings. The One Piece series has presented truly epic sword fights and extraordinary visual effects. These moments have cemented themselves as some of the best sword fights in anime history. Please like, comment and also subscribe if you like this video. Thanks for watching and see you.